Oh, it's good. I did my fun little day. So, that's a good day. Amen. Uh, let's talk about some praising before. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. You know what that is? Amen. This is me grateful. That's right. In a good way. Amen. <laughs> All right. This little church here, once again, um, is moving with miracles upon miracles. Amen. 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 And I remember, for those that just came here, I had to give the whole story. So that was the move from my preaching. So this is part of my preaching I'm giving you right now. Amen. So I'll just preach in uh, 20 minutes because I'm going to spend 20 minutes on this one. So here we go. We started with this journey, this journey, very, very hard. Amen. But uh, it was a year and a half, two years ago. And um, when we started this journey, we thought it was going to be an easy thing. Now, you know about the, the American Dream Act, that's what it is, the Dream Act. It's for a young kid that's uh, trying to have the green card so they can apply to get the uh, I think authorization, something. So they can go to school, but they don't want to get the paper, the authorization. So we said, you know what? Let's see if we can get that for one of our young person here in this church. Because she wants to go to graduate, and she wants, she wants to go to college, and she wants to go to school. She wants to have a complete that something. Yes. So now, we went and tried to find out and it took us a year. After we find out about it, it took us one year, church, to move up on it. See how things slow? But everything works in the end of that. Amen. It's been proven in this church when things doesn't look right, it, it looks pretty wrong, that will turn wrong to you. Amen. And it happened in this church many times over and That's over the truth, again. Brother. So after one year, nothing is done, and we said, well, you know what, let's start this process. Because time is getting close. And then now when we went to see a lawyer, you know, it wasn't a big lawyer either. You know, to get your papers, you want to spend ten thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars. It was a free lawyer. Guess where it was? That lawyer was working for a church. Hallelujah. Guess what church it was? Hey man, hallelujah. The church that doesn't lack as much. <laughs> That's the church the lawyer was working for. If you know what I mean by the way, Solomon. <laughs> and the lawyer said, oh, that child, there is uh, another law that I can file for that child. And that law will give her just uh, a working friend. That law will give her her big car. He said, what? He said, we didn't know anything about it. He said, that's okay. That's my job. Said, I know about it. So he said, let's try for it. He said, but the, if the person has to be 18, under 18 years old. And he was... October and the person is turning 18 in January 3rd. Mm. Mm. Uh, we went to the courthouse, the lawyer fill out the paper, and they give us a date to go to judge for that um was just say yes, you can go ahead. January 2nd. Mm. And the birthday is January 3rd. Yes, January 3rd. hallelujah. Amen. We said, oh my god, this thing ain't gonna happen. But we went anyway. And we went, and the judge said, Oh, you want to show that. The uh, girl is still underage, and then the according to the law, she has to be abandoned. So all that, he said, that's what you want to put. The judge agreed. He said, oh, we made it. And the next day, she's 18. And then the lawyer took his sentence to immigration. Immigration denied. Immigration said, well, she's 18 now. She, she can take care of herself. Ah, he said, oh, my God. I thought everything was all right. We were so happy. Now our uh, balloons start deflating. And we said, oh, okay, but we, we have a God. Amen. You know, in his name is Jesus Christ. Amen. And we still believe in him. Amen. And we, we, we still love, well, let's move forward. And the Lord said, well, let's go back to the court and make sure the, the judge uh, adjusted in saying that even though she's 18, but she has to, you know, she still has, she still has to do a lot of things to still have to take care of herself. So make it like 20, until she was 23. That's what the Lord said. When she went to the judge, she just said, well, you know what? I don't want you guys to come back. That is what I'm here. I'm just going to make it indefinite. So that's it. Now, when the lawyer took it and sent it back to immigration, and immigration replied, everybody was denied, yes. and they replied, and we used to let it in my hand.
hands for unbelievers. Yes, hallelujah. Those people in my hands, that's uh, welcome. Notice, we have your green card. We'll send it to you in three weeks. Hey, hallelujah. <laughs> What that can do. Yes. This is not the first time this no. church has done that. We have American citizens now. Hallelujah. We have helped to get their papers. Yes. And the way it works is very simple. It's to prayer and have faith and yes. believe Amen. in the ministry that God has Hallelujah. You know, but I don't want to delay that. This is the testimony I've given you. Yes. I want that person to come and give you her testimony. Hey, Amen. Because God is moving, I told you. That's the truth. Now the name of that person is
Sorry, I go to a Jewish song. Yeah. Oh, well, it's good. I think David would get some that song like that. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise so, his name, uh, bro. Well, congratulations, Jenny. And welcome to our very guys.